Welcome to today's event. Your objective for today will be to earn the most number of points. You will earn points by taking the item your team has been provided and selling it to anyone you meet in an effort to make a profit. In the end, the team that can return with the most number of items sold and the largest profit will walk away as today's Sidewalk Sale Champions. All right, let's take a closer look at what today's event will entail. Every team in this room has been pre-assigned their own unique item. Upon exiting the room, you can go anywhere you want in an effort to sell your product to anyone you meet. You can price your product at any rate you deem appropriate with the understanding that your objective will be to sell the most number of items at the highest profit. Once you have sold an item, you can use that money to purchase one or multiple items that you can in turn sell again. You will only have a certain amount of time to complete this challenge and your return time back to headquarters can be found on your Rules of Engagement handout. Scoring points is quite simple. For every item you sell, you'll receive 30 points. For every dollar you bring back, you'll receive 10 points. Throughout the event, you'll be operating on the honor system, so please, no cheating. You will also be required to track your sales and purchases using the provided inventory log, which can be found on the back of your Rules of Engagement handout. Now, to ensure everyone is on a level playing field, let's take a look at the Rules of Engagement. Number one, you can sell your item to anyone you meet, but you cannot sell it to anyone associated with this group or that is also participating in the sidewalk sale. Number two, at no point may you use your own money to purchase new items and all the cash you return to headquarters with must be from the sale of the items you purchased. Number three, after your first sale is complete, you may purchase any item you want and in any quantity you desire to help increase your total point value. The only items you may not be allowed to purchase are anything having to do with alcohol, tobacco, firearms, or any other type of illegal substance. Number four. Throughout the course of the event, you must stay together as a team, and at no point may any of your team members be any further than 20 yards from one another. And last but not least, number five. You can go anywhere you desire to sell your items, but just be aware that you must be back to headquarters by the time stated on the rules of engagement. For every minute after this time, we will deduct five points from your overall score. If for some reason you decide to lollygag longer than eight minutes, your team will be disqualified and you will most likely live out the rest of your life in shame. Other than that, good luck, and now let's turn it back over to your event MC.